Yo, what's up guys, it's Jesso Gaming here, and welcome back to Battlefield Hardline. Alright, let's go. So where did Alexandre Daddario is in the game? So what have you been doing these days? Same old. Local or offshore? Mostly offshore. Where am I going? Follow the road, I'll tell you when to turn. So are you, like, enjoying the work? I'm enjoying the money. So what do you do, Nick? I work with Boomer. Oh, boy's up to no good. So exciting. <laughs> so how's your dad? Is he still carrying that fucking gun? Marcus. The world is not your own personal diorama. He's over it. All right, I gotta know what happened with you two. Well, we could... Marcus and I were very much in love. Mm. My father didn't approve. Oh, I can give you one guess why. So when Marcus left the community, he tried mm, to racism. kidnap me, my dad said, mm. which was so fucking romantic, but which kind of upset my dad, I guess. Show him your bracelet. Oh, GPS. So he always knows where I am. <laughs> Great. That's a bit, um, overreacting, overprotective, I guess, but... Tell you this much, ain't no way in hell that I would wear a fucking so tracking device for my parents to know where I'm at, where I am, 24/7. Due to problems with the socialist tyranny of the American government, he founded a community of like-minded patriots. Patriots? Are guys here armed? Totally armed. Oh, Nick, it's cool. I know these people. They're mostly hippies. Actually, all the hippies you knew are gone. What? Where'd they go? Just gone. Dirt road straight ahead, that's ours. Here we are! By the way, I'm muting my microphone all the time because for some reason there is some kind of interference in my microphone. It's like some kind of well, background well. noise. Not like no background noise, but like... Yeah. Hey, Mr. Albert. Thanks for seeing us. That's the least I can do. Yeah, this one, this sound. You must be Nick. Boomer says you got a machine that can brute force any combination lock. Well, certainly can, Nick. You just got to give it a little time. Nick Mendoza, right? Oh, hey, look at that. Shit just got real. My dad kind of monitors my calls. Yeah, a lot of people want to talk to you, Mendoza. Including a fella from LA named Stoddard. Say he'd pay 250 grand for you alive. He's coming here right now. Sorry, Marcus. Boys, what do you say we escort Mr. Mendoza and Marcus down to the presidential suite? Wait, you said just Nick. <laughs> Marcus isn't welcome here. So he she won. played me from the beginning. She knew about this. I'm so sorry. Kill her off this asshole before I puke. Oh, and Marcus, just so we're clear, race is not a factor here. My dislike of you is strictly personal. Yeah, that's what they all say. What the fuck is going on? He straight away attacked me, and plus, there is no fucking sound. How come? And I have handcuffs on. What the fuck is going on? Alright, so, um, I fixed the problem, the sound is back, but... <laughs> I also 
hopefully fix the microphone problem with that. Shoot, buddy. No hard feelings, man. Why is it everything so dark? And he just walked through the door. No hard feelings, man. The fuck is this shit? All right. Bro, he's flying now. Can't shoot the gun. You wanna watch TV? Bro, I feel like this is a glitch. He's not supposed to be here, is he? Or I think he has uh, he had to open the door. Don't do it. Bro, there's so many glitches in this game. Man, the thing is if I restart from the checkpoint, I think the checkpoint was where we all were in the car. That's where the checkpoint was. Okay, you know what? Let's see what happens. Hey! Fuck! Okay, now I can shoot. I'm pretty sure he was supposed to open the damn door. But he just walked through it. It's so dark in here, I'm trying to spark some light on it. Fuck's sake. I can't believe that this game has so many glitches like that, bro. Like, what was that? My dude just walked through the door. And like I said, we're back from the where we were. Okay, so... I'm not moving. If he walks through that door again, I'm gonna be so pissed. Ah, fuck. Bro! Hands up! Stay right where you are. Hey, don't shoot, buddy! No hard feelings, man! Bro, he walks through the door! I guess I can't complete the mission. My dude just walks through the door. What can I do? Explain. And the saddest part is I have to restart from that. I don't. I don't. I. I. I, I, I really don't understand. Maybe because of the resync. Could that be the problem? Probably not. It saved. It showed that it saved here. Let's exit to me. Oh my goodness, bra! Motherfucker! Hey, keep those hands where I can see them. Hey, don't shoot, buddy. No hard feelings. Hey! God damn it! Bro. It's GG. I can't complete the game. I can't complete the game. It's it's over. This is it. Yep. Alright, so I looked it up. It's... Uh, 
it's not as uncommon as you might think. That problem has appeared for many people. So they say that the problem to fix it is to <laughs> is to limit your FPS. And I know it's mo it's gonna sound silly, but frame limit must be three FPS. <laughs> <laughs> so the video is gonna be a bit laggy. Wait, you said just Nick. Okay, I hope is now it's gonna be right. Here? Otherwise, I you just can't won. be asked anymore, bro. Oh, baby, I'm so sorry. Not yet. Off this asshole before I puke. Not yet. Oh, and Marcus, just not like yet. Race is not a factor here. My dislike of you is strictly personal. There we go. But it's gonna be 3 FPS. It works! Yes! Look, there's a cutscene that never happened. I have relatively good news. Really? Don't mind the lags, it's gonna be just till we get through the door. Doom gave it to me when she hugged me. Doom. Who just set us up? Doom. Who set you up? She's, uh... She's actually really good people. Oh, sure. We're nearly through. Just don't All mind right. the lag. Stay behind me. Okay, yeah, go ahead. All right, we through the door. Wait. All right, so uh, I typed in game time max variable FPS uh, 120. It works, right? But I don't know how. Wait, actually, let me close that. Is it off? It is. I don't know what was my previous frame rate. Variable FPS. I really don't know what was my previous one, so I'm just gonna put to 40. We gotta find a way out of here. Ain't no argument here. Dude, it took me 10 minutes to get to this point. What the hell is this place anyway? 10 minutes of the video, but in real life, almost an hour. Uh, please tell me Alfred doesn't have a nuke. I don't have a nuke. Got another one. Okay, this way. Can't believe how hard it was to. Bro, why does glitches like that exist? Something like that happened in. Something like that happened. <laughs> I know I'm pausing the game a lot already because, like, but something like that happened in Mass Effect first game when I had to look for a fix in order to record, and something like that happened also in, uh, shit. What was it? I I forgot already. Oh, and the second game where I had to look for fix was uh, Grand Theft Auto 4. When I couldn't, in the last mission, when I couldn't get into the fucking uh, chopper. Because when I pressed to climb in, it's like the video was glitching. So I had to, uh, yeah, I had to go in task manager and set CPU, many, uh, stuff like that. Yeah. So. Not many. Okay, come on, let's find that escape hatch. I only have 11 bullets, so let's make them count. And let's try to stealth attack them as much as I can. Wait here. <laughs> uh. 
He doesn't have any bullets, really. Hang back. Let me handle this. Like that Marcus Keene anyway. Think, Little fucking know it all. Can't believe you guys used to let scumbags like that live around here. Shit. We had them, Mexicans, hippies, some fucking dude, I don't know what he was. Once Tony took over, he changed the whole scene pronto. Hey, <laughs> the Mexican, he was a cop. Way too many cops around here. Yeah, well, he's not a cop anymore. Tony says he busted out of prison a couple days ago. So who's the guy paying the cops' bounty? Tony doesn't know. Found his number on the uh, the ATF agent's phone. A quarter million bucks for a Mexican. Shit, man, I didn't know they got so expensive. Someone should go check on those assholes. See if they're thirsty. Then, not give them anything to drink. How much you wanna bet that if I try to take him out silently they're gonna you know what at this point I swear I had this thing <sighs> oh. Bro I'm wasting bullets because of really little shit but at least I got more back let's go if you glitch I'm gonna be pissed Hey, one of these idiots had my scanner. Hey, there's a ladder. That's the way out. Yeah. Come on. Excuse me? We need to get our gear back. What? Are you nuts? Let's just get out of here! Look, if Stoddard gets his hands on it, he'll trace it right back to Kai and Tyson. Okay, we can't risk that. Shit. Alright, so how you want to take this, man? There's a lot of Alpert's dudes down there. Uh, looks like there's a place to climb in on the left. Okay, but, but, or we could crawl under that fence over there on the right. Yeah, or we could take them head on. What? If you're up for that. Man, you lead. I'll be right behind you. That's what I thought. Unfortunately. Let's just go. Come on. You will get this black man killed. I feel it. Nick. It buzzed right here. you have any uh, other friends? Gonna skin it. Not out here. Ain't that kind of a waste? What am I, a fucking Choctaw? Circle of life. <laughs> Man, I'm telling you, you ain't ever gonna get that old heap of yours to run. What the hell are you talking about? Your spark plug insulator tips are cracked, for one. Yeah, I, I just changed them. <laughs> Someone must have swapped them out. Come on. I still get one warrant. So if he's anywhere, he's probably here. Has to be, right? Bro, they're just walking through the... Right out. Gonna check this out. <clears throat> this 
bro. I nearly killed him. Fuck. Good thing I scanned him. Fuck you, you little shit. Bro. Do you mind? like mine back which one I had this one I think Something's not right. That's the evidence. Okay. Something more I'm missing. How do I get up there? The fuck, dude. One more missing. <laughs> all right. Is that all of them? Yep. Now I can get out of here. Thanks for the help, bro. Guys, right here, get in. Come on, quick, get in the car. You're coming with us? Man, I sure do keep interesting people around. The ones that betray me. First guy now, hey, dude. You wanna talk about what's going on here? It's like these guys are geared up for their old private apocalypse. Yeah, Tony's kinda flipped his lid. You think? What do you guys even need a safe cracking robot for anyway? Uh, to steal something? Well, at least it's being used for a noble cause. Head for the airstrip, that's where your brood is. Okay, and you're sure it's there? Yes, I'm sure, that's where Tony keeps all his crap. Just drive. What's with the attitude? Oh, there's one thing I want to know. Oh, just one? Hey, well, there's hey, a lot of things I'd like to could know. Could you just hang on? Dooney, why'd you let your dad lure us into a trap? I assumed Nick was just one of your dirtbag friends, but then I found out he's a cop, which is kind of worse, but whatever. Whatever? Whatever? You know you're covering with us now, right? Oh, really? Jesus! Oh, fuck! Boomer! What if instead I turn you both over to this Stoddard person and collect my 250 grand? What the hell, woman? <laughs> I'm totally messing with you 
guys. How about you don't swing that around? Okay. Well, that one is. <laughs> That's what's definitely loaded. <laughs> Woo. Oh well, now she's in it, which means I have to protect her ass as well. Man, just what I needed. Okay? Hit. That shot in the arm. Yeah, my leg's broken. Oh, we gotta get you some help. Man, I literally have to carry her ass. Remember this thing? Right. Nick. Hold him off while I do some triage. There's guns in the trunk. You got it. I thought you said work. her leg is broken. A lot. How can she walk with a broken leg? Whoa, jeez, bro. This is our plan B. Can I use it? Jeez, bro. Okay. How am I getting here? Okay, you know what? Fucking asshole. Get up there! Oh. You didn't hit shit. Hmm. Uh. Excuse me, fifty meters. Oh, you mean here? Do you mind? There's two of them! It's a bit of an overkill. Jeez. Oh my god. Of course. Bro, it's like... What is this? I can't even get a clear shot because I can't see where the fucking head is. Because of the fucking bullets flying. Like, Jesus. He's out of Dude, I literally
Bro. There's too much going on, I didn't even count. I can't even get close to them. How is he still hitting me, bro? Bro, I can't get a clear shot on this motherfucker. What the fuck? They just keep driving around and I can't see where I'm shooting. I, 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 like, I, <laughs> I, I fucking shot him and I jumped away from the car, but of course it hit me. Man. Oh, uh, how am I getting hit? What's the point of the walls if they can't fucking protect me? Bro, I can't see a fucking thing. What the fuck just happened? Where did they That's go? They just despawned, bro. <laughs> Jesus. Nice fucking car. Hey, you okay? I need you to do me a favor. Tony's a hunter, so I could use a diversion. I decided I kind of hate the desert. So you're not coming with us? We can get you to a hospital. Nah, you seem kind of busy. Airfield's that way, you better hurry. Hey, Dooney. Oh, yeah. Good luck. See you around? And tell Tony I think he's away. I wonder why would you say that? No, I already got everything. Or maybe. Yeah, I got everything.
I don't like the fact that we don't have any doors. But dad's gonna come after us with everything he's got, you know. Not we leave first. It's an airfield, right? Maybe we'll find a plane. So, uh, what did do mean when she said Tony keeps all his crap at this airstrip? Tony's always kind of collected shit. The less legal, the better. Really? So what are we talking about here? Military black market shit. Tanks, choppers. He's even got a couple of grounded flags. Tony's got a lot of money, man. Drug stuff. He's real literal about his Second Amendment rights. Yo, that's it. It's old airfield. Keep going. Airfield's just ahead. You know, I find it hard to believe you were a cop. Yeah. Well, my dad was a cop, too. For real? Not the kind you're thinking of. You know the SDE? Cuban secret police? Oh, okay, wait, what? So what? You, you followed in his footsteps? Hey, you tell me, man. His job was torturing prisoners. And he liked to bring his work home, you know what I mean? That's why I became a cop. A real cop. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry that didn't work out. Well, it turns out you don't have to be a cop to stop people like him. Time to walk. Come on. I have five bullets. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> Hello. Woo. Oh, yeah, she's pretty and banged up, but I think. Yeah. ETF agent Barnes was working for Dawes and Stoddard. He had a dossier on Boomer and came out to Albert's camp looking for him. Probably the idea was that Boomer might lead to me. Bit of a long shot, but hell, worth sending a guy. Seems like Albert got worried that Barnes would figure out his nutjob plan to start a civil war. So he has the guy killed and tortured for no good reason. It's not like he knew anything. Least I can do is make a call to the FBI tip line. I'm not sure I want to fly a broken plane you fixed. What? No offense. Man, what are you trying to say, man? Are you doubting Boomer? Man, get out of here. I can fix this. I'll go find the brute. Radio's on, all right? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Radio's on. Nice. At least I got bullets now. Wait, they still had... Okay, how... I have all the evidence and I had my warrants, so oh, shit. I Ooh, guess everything works out. These guys are already here. Uh, 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 do you see like a, uh, uh, a warehouse across the way? Yeah, yeah, it's barricaded. You can't sneak in. Oh, hang on. Yeah, hey, I think I got an idea. It might be a little loud. Man, that's a bit of an oracle. I died. Why wouldn't I fucking die? Uh, yeah, that makes fucking sense. Hmm. And of course, I'm. Fuck's sake! Like, what is up with the checkpoints? Can somebody explain me that, bro? Oh, 
shit. And I can't skip this shit as well. Tony's guys are already here. Uh, uh, do you see like a, uh, uh, a warehouse across the way? Yeah. Yeah, it's barricaded. You can't sneak in? Oh, hang on. Hey, I think I got an idea. Might be a little loud. Alright, I think, I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Give a like if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe. And next time we come back, we're just gonna continue to play this game. So yeah, anyways, see ya.